picture this. You're in your early 20s, full of energy and excitement for what lies ahead. But amidst the thrill of youth, there's a hidden truth, one that often gets overlooked until it's too late. Your 20s are a fleeting phase in which you have unparalleled ability to shape your life in ways that will resonate for decades to come. Today, we're going to uncover five fundamental pillars that will empower you to make the most of these crucial years. So if you're ready to unlock the secrets of a fulfilling life, well, listen closely because this episode of the Fallible Man podcast might just change everything for you. Here's the million dollar question. How do men like us reach our full potential, grow into the men we dream of being while taking care of our responsibilities, working, being good husbands, fathers, and still take care of ourselves? Well, that's the big question. In this podcast, we'll help you answer those questions and more. My name is Brent, and welcome to the Fallible Man Podcast. Welcome to another episode of the Fallible Man Podcast, your home for all things man, where we delve into the wisdom and experience that shapes the journey of manhood. A big shout out to Fallible Nation. You guys make these shows possible, and a warm welcome to our first-time listeners, Thanks for checking us out. I hope you enjoy the show. My name is Brent, and in this episode, we're focused on the pivotal years of your 20s. The time when you stand at the threshold of adulthood, armed with the power to shape your future. It's a period of immense potential and opportunity, but it's also a time when your choices you make can have lasting consequences. Today, we're going to explore five crucial points that every man in his 20s should consider to set himself up for a lifetime of fulfillment, success, and personal growth. So whether you're a young man just starting this journey or someone looking back to those formative years, this episode is for you. So let's dive in. Number one, health habits. When you're in your 20s, you're at the apex of your body's physical capabilities. You will never be able to control your strength, your weight, your physique, or your overall health like you can in this age range. If you're under 25, you may think this is an exaggeration, but you're still living on your youth and fast metabolism. Between 23 and 25, it will start to catch up. It only becomes more difficult to undo the bad choices with every passing year. Establishing and maintaining a healthy lifestyle in and through your 20s will set you up for a lifetime of success with your health. Imagine going into your 30s with a decade of solid sleep habits, healthy eating habits, and a solid fitness routine. You're going to be a powerhouse for the rest of your life. And unless you throw out everything drastically and purposely the thirties and on are just going to be amazing for you. Number two, build your skill set. Now is the time. Stop consuming entertainment. Anything that gives you a dopamine hit without having to do your work is an enemy. I know that sounds drastic, but it's true. And it's something you learn later in life. So please take this little tidbit of wisdom. Wisdom. It's not just me saying this guys. If you can't learn from it or earn from it, then stay away from it. Read books that teach you things. Take courses, classes, and get in masterminds. Apprentice if that aligns with your goals, because that may be the best option. One of the most powerful things I ever learned from a friend was this. Do the work first, work hard, get it all done before you play. That way, once you start playing, you don't have to stop. Guys, that truth has shaped my life for decades, and it's one of the most valuable pieces of information that was ever imparted to me. Too many 20-year-olds think that they should party and have fun while they're young. Well, use your 20s to build the skills that will make the next 60 years amazing instead. Number three, actively seek your purpose. Purpose is often misunderstood. There's not one thing. That's, that's, that's not how purpose works. There's not like one thing that you have to do with the rest of your life. You're meant to do a great many things in your life, but there's one person you're meant to be, something that is powerful about you, something that inevitably, no matter what you do, it will find its way into your life over and over and over again. Hindsight is a truly powerful thing as you get later in life. And I can look back at my life and see several times where This was true. No matter where I landed, I saw these same traits, these same key pieces of my life and the way I played in them over and over and over again. So be observant during these years and learn what it is that is your purpose, your calling or who you're meant to be. 
It will shape your life forever. And sooner you identify it, embrace it and lean into it, the happier you will be in life. Men have a much more fulfilling, successful and joyful life when they align with their purpose. Number four, guys, build your future. Now's the time to build the future you want to build. I mean, now is the opportunity. Learn about finances, investing, business, real estate, sales, marketing, and entrepreneurship, if I can say it. Dabble, build businesses, make investments, take professional risk. Get serious about what you want for your future. Set goals, dream big. And again, if you can't learn from it or earn from it, then you should probably stay away from it for this part of your life. We live in an exciting time where if you work intelligently and intentionally in your 20s, then the rest of your life can be easy and successful. It's truly an amazing time period to be alive. 10 years of calculated, intentional actions can set you up for life. And at the very least, it will set up your set you up for life. Number five, build a strong tribe, but maintain yourself as an island. Now, I know that sounds kind of like an oxymoron, guys, but I promise I'm going to make it make sense. Surround yourself with a powerful tribe. The world is truly impacted by who you know and who knows you. But be choosy about that tribe. Find a tribe full of people who are talking money, success, business, entrepreneurship, personal development, growth. Build real connections with those kind of people. The truth is, if you're lucky, you'll have four or five real friends in your life. These are the friends that you can like call in the middle of the night. There's no explanation when you're like, hey, bring a shovel. That's a friend. However, maintain your ability to be an island. 99.99%, and I know we like to throw out statistics, right? 99.99% of the people you're trying to impress don't care about you. If you die today, who will still miss you 10 years from now? only your family. So learn to love yourself and be confident in who you are with your abilities. First, learn to be powerful in being yourself and being on your own. That there's, there's incredible power in being content and comfortable when you're alone. But if you can master that, you'll thrive. If you can master being strong enough to be alone while surrounding yourself with other high value men, I guarantee it. Now, you know me, I always like to add one more because, you know, freebies, right? So number six, guys, learn to plug your energy leaks. Time and attention are your most valuable, precious, and limited commodities. So learn to set healthy boundaries, ignore distractions, and distance yourself from drama. Things that rob you of your mental, emotional, and spiritual energy are prevalent in our, in our society today. Pointless arguments online or otherwise. People take people who take, 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 take. Gossip. People that add drama and stress. Comparing yourself to others and useless vices like alcohol, tobacco, being overweight, pornography. These all cause self-loathing, shame, and our emotional, mental, and spiritual drains. They will steal from your life incredibly. You're going to grow older sooner than you think. There's an old saying the days are long, but the decades are short. Life is too short to let these things take away from you, to let it rob you of your potential for your future. Now, guys, some of you will notice I didn't talk about women. In fact, that was intentionally left out. I didn't talk about women in relationships because this is what is true. The value of a man goes up with time, experience, and age. Start building and you will find that high value and low value women come around. You don't have to go looking for it. They will find you if you're building yourself. So just be really careful which ones you pay attention to. If she doesn't reflect your own ideals, dreams, your work ethic, and your goals, she'll only distract you. An amazing woman will be an active partner that adds to the overall value of your life and works with you to achieve those goals. The wrong kind of women will just waylay your goals and dreams, distract you from your bigger goals, and take away from your overall quality of life. These are not the kind of women you want to surround yourself with. But I promise you, if you invest these other six things we covered and start building yourself into the man you intend to be for the rest of your life, women will find you. You don't have to go looking. 
And there you have it, guys, a powerful guide to navigating your 20s and crafting a life full of purpose, prosperity, and self-discovery. Remember, healthy habits form the foundation of everything else, and it's easier to start in your 20s. It just gets harder as you go. So prioritize your well-being above all else. Embrace the art of building your skill set, investing your future, and actively seeking your purpose, knowing that it's not a singular thing, but a journey of self-discovery. Cultivate a strong tribe of like-minded individuals who inspire growth, but never forget the strength of being content in your own company. As you step into adulthood, armed with this wisdom, may you face the challenges and opportunities ahead with courage and determination. Now, guys, it is Friday, and we always like to reach out and listen and share our user reviews. So I wanted to share with you this incredible review from Bernard Winsaki. I probably got that wrong because they're from Germany, so I'm sorry. Left as a five-star review, says, Empowering men, unveiling the secrets to fulfilling roles as fathers, husbands, and individuals. This podcast is special as men take on important roles in life as fathers, husbands, and also as individuals. It's time to support them in this. This is about strengthening men and their own competencies in order to meet the demands, but also to do justice to themselves. Absolutely worth listening to. Thank you so much, Bernard. Bernard, Bernard, I'm so sorry. I know I'm butchering that if you're listening to this. Thank you. You guys taking the time to leave us a review always means so very, very much to a small podcast like us. Guys, thanks for tuning in to the Fallible Man podcast. Stay true to yourself. Embrace the journey and remember, the power to shape your destiny lies in your hands. Until next time, be better tomorrow because of what you do today, and we'll see you on the next one. This has been the Fallible Man Podcast, your home for everything man, husband, and father. Be sure to subscribe so you don't miss a show. Head over to www.thefallibleman.com for more content and get your own Fallible Man gear.